Kansas is known nationwide for its big buck hunting, and firearms deer season is currently underway until December 12th. Hunters should be aware that chronic wasting disease, or CWD, has made its way into the northwestern corner of the state. And though the chance of encountering an infected deer is very remote, Kansas Wildlife and Parks is interested in testing a large sample of deer taken statewide during the current hunting season. Chronic wasting disease was first found in a Kansas wild deer in Cheyenne County in 2005. This strange disease developed slowly in an infected animal, finally resulting in death. It spreads directly from animal to animal through saliva and other bodily secretions, making bait stations and water guzzlers prime infection sites. There is no evidence that CWD can spread from deer or elk to humans or livestock, but precautions are in order. First, avoid wild animals that appear to be sick. Wear rubber gloves when field dressing game and avoid eating tissues and organs other than muscle. Wash and disinfect hands in all processing areas when butchering your own venison. If possible, have your deer tested at a CWD testing facility found in many towns. This service is free and easy and it helps track the possible spread of CWD in Kansas. The Kansas Department of Wildlife and Parks website lists locations for free testing sites. Lymph nodes taken from between the deer's eye and ear, as well as teeth for aging, are sent to Kansas State University for evaluation, so you'll not know the outcome of your tested deer unless it turns out positive. In that case, you'll be notified. Samples call for brief information such as hunter contact info and where the deer was shot. Kansas Wildlife and Parks has collected and tested more than 20,000 samples since 1996, and the goal will be approximately 2,900 samples for the 2010-2011 season. More information about chronic wasting disease and testing can be found in the 2010 Hunting and Fur Harvesting Regulations Summary. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.